Shout out to Drewski. He got this new reality TV show called Could Have Been House. It's an offshoot of Could Have Been Records. He got this giant mansion with all these people in there. And they all competing for $50,000. He even got Crip Mac on there. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to Crip Mac. You know what I mean? Because Adam22 did him dirty ever since he got Brick Baby. And uh, um, what's his name? Uh, Flame. So Crip Mac got an ankle monitor. So they come up with a plan to get Crip Mac's ankle monitor off. So they find the weakest link. <laughs> a rapper called the ugliest rapper. <laughs> Technical. They see that he the weakest link. So they persuade him to take off Crip Mac's ankle monitor. He's taking it off. We all know this is a federal offense taking off somebody's ankle monitor. Mind you, he's doing it on camera. So he got this special tool to take it off uh, without damaging it. <laughs> see this right there so he takes it off and this is the mole cool cool he is the one that basically manipulated ugly rapper to take it off or he was trying to prove himself either or so crip mac is just sitting there while old dude taking his ankle monitor off so dude then took it off he got it. he about to put it in his pocket now <laughs> dude got it in his pocket you know what i'm saying he like he down you know what i'm saying <laughs> He down for and said he put it work. He got that. He gonna keep it. So he got it. He keep it. He gonna hide it somewhere. You feel me? So he gone. He out of there. <laughs> they looking back. They sitting back laughing like, yeah, we got another one. So mind you, it's 2.07 p.m. So dude then took off the ankle monitor and he's trying to give it back to Cool Cool. The one that uh, basically manipulated him to, to take it off in the first place. Cool Cool like, nah, bro. You keep that. Hold on to this. <laughs> so now he's looking around for his next uh, victim. You know what I mean? Because now that they took off the ankle monitor, they still have the tool. So now he got to get rid of the tool. So he's looking around. He plotting. He see this dude right here. He like, hold this down for me. So he put the tool in his pocket. <laughs> Dude, like you, you better not tell nobody. Do like technical. Dude, like how you just go put me into this family? Hold on, violation, family violation. The dude was like, man, you better not say nothing. <laughs> so he basically found the second weakest link. So he got a person to take off a Crip Max ankle monitor, and then he got the person to take the tool so dude right here cool cool he didn't set up the whole play he liked the dude in prison that be sitting back manipulating plays and you know what i mean setting up plays so now that he didn't got rid of the, the anchor monitor and the tool he go report back to drewski like yeah bro glock got it you know what <laughs> glock got it family and they're like who if you had to choose who was the most suspicious person around who <laughs> would y'all pick <laughs> No Glock around this bug. <laughs> Looking paranoid because he accessory to a felony. <laughs> on camera, family. On camera. So Drewski like, yeah, we got another one, family. Glock. So Glock is the one with the tool. They like, yeah, Glock got it. He's cool. Is reporting everything back to Drewski. He's setting up everything. He the undercover mole. He the he the undercover snitch. You know what I mean in the group. So Glock is just look. He just looking paranoid. He looking like a, a, a deer in the headlights. Like, bro, you look guilty as hell, bro. So then, after Crip Mac leave, and they got his ankle monitor and his tool to take off the ankle monitor, the police show up, family. The police show up to the, to the, um, the police show up to the property. And they like, all right, so we got an ankle monitor on site. It's in the house. They looking at the GPS right now. The ankle monitor is in this house. We don't know if Crip Mac is here or not, but the ankle monitor is here. We need to recover our property. This is the ankle monitor that I showed you in the beginning of the video. So the police get everybody together and they like, the ankle monitor is in there. Who knows what? Y'all got to tell me something. So Drewski come out like, oh, what's this one? Technical, family technical. They was like, we need to know where our property is or where is Crip Mac. Popo talking to him. And they like, does anybody have any information on this ankle monitor or this tool? We need to recover our property. So they get Drewski. They, they, they basically detain him. They set him aside. You know what I mean? They talk to him for a minute. And he's like explaining to him, bro, I don't know what's going on. I'm just here shooting a movie. Police is like, we saw the GPS monitor on our phone. 
we know what's in the house. We need to recover our property. So the police started questioning the whole group. They like, somebody knows something. Somebody better speak right now or we're going to shut down the whole entire shoot. The whole entire reality show is going to be over. Y'all messing up sponsors and everything. So the ugly rapper raises his hand, family, and they're like, what, bro? You talking to the Popo Technical family? You a snitch. So the suspect is the snitch. He the first one to go talk to the police. So the suspect is the snitch. He the first one to go talk to the police. And he But homie had a little black box on his leg that he cut off. Technical family, you just snitched in front of Just by the look of him, you could tell he gonna snitch. Technical. <laughs> he even dap up the police like, all right, we, we partners. Boy, you the suspect. Talk about we friends. No, we ain't friends. Tack. Everybody like, bro, if you know where it's at, just go get it, bro. If you got the anchor monitor, just go get it so we can continue uh, recording this TV show, bro. You gonna mess up the whole TV show. Drewski locked up. He in the police car. All because of you, family. All because of you. And he like, I don't know nothing. I don't know nothing. Let's all go look for it. They like, bro, just go in the house and go look for it. So dude, go in the house. <laughs> He, he he go in the house, he acting guilty. He the only one speaking out of everybody. He the only one talking. He public, he pulling the police to the side, whispering in their ear, technical boy, your ass is guilty, cuz. They basically they basically threatening him, bro. We're gonna shut this down and Drewski gonna go to jail if you don't find this ankle monitor. This is a felony. You need to stop playing, bro. Tell us where it's at so we can continue filming. We're going to lose sponsors. We're going to lose revenues. We're going to lose all kind of things. We're going to lose $50,000 for all y'all contestants. Y'all going to lose y'all money too, bro, if y'all don't, if you don't tell us what's going on. Question him, bro, how you get the anchor monitor off? He's like, I didn't take it off. I didn't take it off. Mind you, he did it in front of everybody on camera. So everybody know who took it off. He lying. He lying. This boy been lying so much, he done lost his teeth. Cause technical. <laughs> Meanwhile, they're like, man, Juski about to go to jail, bro. Why is you doing this? Why is you doing this? Juski like, man, this is some BS. They go, cut him need some milk. Cut him need some water. Cut him, him need a vitamin shot. <laughs> a Capri Sun or something. <laughs> so, dude, like, all right, man, I'm going to give it up. I'm going to tell, cuz. It was him. It was cool, 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 cool. So he like, all right, bro, it was, I'm a, he did it. Cool, cool, did it. <laughs> this bro, he pointing in there. <laughs> I swear to God. <laughs> Man, liars always be talking about it, I swear to God. That's all my kids, I swear to God. That's all my mama. <laughs> Boy, your ass is lying. You guilty, good. So then, so then old dude get back to the group after he get done snitching on everybody. Mind you, Cool Cool is the one that's right there at the left. He, he he the one looking at him crazy. If you ever see anybody looking at you like that, just know they gonna get down with you. If not now, later. That that look right there, that look means something. Look at the girl. Look at the dude with the <laughs> with the blonde hair. <laughs> They're like, bro, you a snitch. <laughs> we all see you, snitch family. So this is Cool Cool right here. This is the one. So Cuckoo is the one that he snitched on. See how he looking? Look, he like, bro, you snitched on me? Mind you, he the one that set up the whole play. He the one that, you know what I'm saying, basically told dude, hey, bro, go take this ankle monitor off. And dude was trying to prove himself and got himself into some mix. You know what I'm saying? So, so Glock, the one that was, uh, he said, don't say nothing. I'm going to beat you up. Hold this down. So he come out with the key. That, that unlocks the ankle monitor. You know what I mean? He gave it to the police. And then... <laughs> and then the rapper dude, the ugly rapper dude, <laughs> he like, there you go, look, see, he did it. He did it. He's telling. He point figures. <laughs> so mind you, this is basically like a, a, a jail reality TV show. So it's like a jail premise. They got Crip Mac, got everybody with, with blue rags, and you got people making commentary meals, <laughs> spreads, all kind of. So it's basically a a, a, um, a prison format uh, reality show type thing. So this dude right here snitched, and the Glock dude is a snitch because he gave the police the evidence. Meanwhile, this dude is the one that took it off, and he giving police evidence. He point fingers and all kinds. He point fingers, all kind of stuff. Technical. So Glock, he like, all right, yeah. 
it was me. I had it. Where you get it from? I don't know where I got it from. Meanwhile, Cool Cool was back there holding his chin, rubbing his hands like Birdman. <laughs> like, boy, you better not say nothing. And look, he can tell. He can feel the eyes on the side of his head, cuz, cuz he's squinting. <laughs> Drewski like, I ain't even do that, bro. I ain't even do that. You know how <laughs> you know how it go when you be in the back of the police car. You ain't did nothing. Nope. I ain't do nothing. <laughs> you responsible for all of this. You in charge. <laughs> I didn't do nothing though. <laughs> it was him, probably. It was him. So they pull him aside and they question him, like, bro, where you get that tool from? Did you get it from Quit Mac? And they like, nah, he like, nah, I didn't get it from Quit Mac. I don't know where I got it from. He's like, I promise you, I don't know where I got it from. I just, somebody gave it to me, and I don't know who it was. I don't remember their name. He's like, I'm a good person. I don't have no record or nothing like that. Who gave it to you? And he like, is this snitching? The police like, well, if he don't go to jail, it ain't snitching. We just want our property back. And he like, are you sure? They like, yeah. So he like, all right, then, I'll tell you. It was cool, cool. Cool, cool did it. He the one that gave it to me. <laughs> cool, cool gave it to me. <laughs> They're like, all right. So we got our we got our uh, property back. You know what I mean? Y'all can continue filming. Drewski, you released. A uh, Mac ain't here. We'll deal with him later. We just wanted our property back. So then they start back filming. Dude go in the house after snitching on everybody. So they got him out corner like, bro, you a snitch, bro, you a snitch. He's like, I didn't even say nothing. I didn't even say nothing. Even little man had to try to stand on business for him, cuz he had to get eye level with everybody to uh to help his partner. He didn't told so much his teeth left. They're like, we ain't got time for this shit. Cool cool tried to beat him down in the kitchen family. They put him in protective custody. I had told you it was like a prison thing. So he in PC now, he in protective custody, cause he in danger, family. <laughs> So then they put uh, they put the ugly rapper dude uh, and, and PC gave it to me. I didn't even really want to do nothing with it. He basically forced me to to take the, the tool. I didn't have nothing to do with it. It was cool, cool. So cool, cool had overheard the conversation and he like, bro, I told you if you say something or if you snitch on me, bro, about me giving you this, I'm gonna beat you down. And then bro was like, get ready. And then you know what I mean. God put his hands up. And then quicker than lightning, family, cool, cool, hit him with that left. I, I wasn't even expecting the left. It was so quick, I had to slow it down to catch it. Technical. It was like a blink of an eye, family. It was like if you blink, his hand was already coming back. I said tactical. Float like a butterfly, sting like a beat. <laughs> slapped him so hard, family, he didn't even realize he was slapped until three seconds later. He had to, he had to feel it. His jaw was numb, family. His jaw was numb. And then he was like, did I just get slapped? Did he just slap me, family tag? Look, oh, help, man down, help. So they had to call the ambulance, family. They had to get him checked out, cuz. They, <laughs> they had to get him evaluated. <laughs> Mind you, Crip Mac had hit him with a left, huh, knocked him down. You know what I'm saying? Um, the ugly dude, he had gorilla punched him on the back a few times. Now, cool, cool, then slap a booger out of him, cuz. <laughs> So this dude, now he embarrassed, he in danger. He probably about to get robbed with all them chains on. I ain't even gonna lie, family. So 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 Drewski went ahead and put him in PC, family. They 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 put him in PC. They had to protect him, cuz he in protective custody after snitching and getting beat down four, five times. Tactical. So the ugly dude, after being in PC, Drewski going there like, yeah, bro, I love what you're doing. I want you to snitch every time. I want you to be my undercover snitch. You feel me? And he gave him a C, family. He had gave him a C for it could have been records. When they add up, they get Sadrewski. Could have been house breakdown. And it's very entertaining. It's crazy. If you get the concept of the show and you just uh, realize that it's a reality TV show and you understand the plays, then you can um, enjoy the show. And I, I believe that people that's playing it may be a little slow and they're not understanding the plot behind the whole thing but a uh, flag on the play flag on the play see what happened was i was patrolling these youtube streets out here with my water go holy water hit it mr no lacking out here just looking for you heathens get back you heathens get back